Asia Pacific presents a very compelling investment propositions today and in the longer term. Now, inflation is running slower, but growth is running faster. And in the next two decades, we would expect that Asia will be the global growth leader. Um, so we still see a lot of compelling opportunities in this region. In Japan, for example, the multifamily sector continues to grow from strength to strength. Uh, from the macro point of view, the interest rate and the policy environment is very equitative to real estate investment. Uh, from the sectorial point of view, the changes in demographics and lifestyles aspirations um, that's giving rise to a group of cohort, what we call the generation rent, and that continues to support very strong demand for rental accommodation. Uh, we continue to see a long runway for growth in Japan multifamily. We also like the prospects in the Korean um, real estate market. I think there has been an increase in institutional interest in South Korea and that really is backed up by a very strong occupier profile. So we do think that investors would do really well to get exposure to the South Korean market.